Hello crafty friends, this is card number 40 in my full deck challenge. This one's going to be pretty simple and quick, but fun and something a little different. To start I'm going to add a layer of white tissue paper with some Mod Podge. This is to allow the paint that I'm going to use to adhere to the card surface. I add a layer of Mod Podge over the tissue paper too. This is so that the tissue paper doesn't tear when I add the paint. You could also use craft glue or gel medium to adhere the tissue paper. Once everything is dry, just trim off the excess. Using acrylic paints, choose two, three or four colors that you would like to use for your card. I've chosen two shades of turquoise and a dark blue. And what we're going to do is we're going to apply it directly onto the card and we're going to do like an ombre effect where one blends into the other. This technique does take a little bit of practice and you will need a couple of layers of paint but it's super fun and it's lovely to see how the colours blend. I'm using a medium sized paintbrush for this, you can use whatever you're comfortable with. Once the first layer is done, I dry that and then I apply a second layer over the top to make it more opaque. It's a little transparent at the moment and a bit streaky. It's never too late to join in my full deck challenge. If you're on Facebook, you can find my group there too. It's a lovely supportive community where you can get inspiration and share your makes. Just search full deck challenge group. Please let me know in the comments below what colors you'll be using for your card. I would love if you subscribed to my channel. I have lots of tips, tutorials and flip throughs coming your way. Also hit the little bell so that you're notified every time I upload new content. I also have a really big Christmas giveaway coming up in October, so watch out for that. I'm just continuing with my second layer of paint and as you can see it's a lot smoother and it's giving a really good ombre effect. Once your paint is dry, we're going to add some details onto the surface. I'm using a black fine liner pen. You could also use a Posca pen, or actually even if you had a white pen would also work, depending on the color you've used. And we're just going to do some doodling. I think this is really relaxing and a lot of fun. Just make some patterns of your choice. They can be just free patterns. You can do writing or text, anything that you like. And it is really fun and just fill the whole face of the card with black or white doodles and it's pretty effective with the ombre color shining through underneath. I think this technique is also a great technique to use in a junk journal or a junk journal page as some decoration or to even make tags for a junk journal and you can make all the colors to suit your theme or um, just specific to your project and like I said it's super quick. I'm just going back and filling some of the little gaps with a solid black this is just to make this pop a little bit more. I really hope you enjoyed this really quick video and this fun technique. I hope you were inspired to give it a go. Do tag me if you do try my cards out. I'd love to see what you do. I'm also on Instagram. Just search Shanuki Art, one word. And thanks again for watching. I will see you again soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.